It's that time of the year for Tampa Bay parents, grandparents, and others who shop for children's toys. Some of those toys can actually be very dangerous. And the Florida Public Interest Group compiled a list of some of the worst of the worst. Eight on your side's Jeff Patterson joins us now. He is live in the Tampa News Center with more on that story. Hi, Jeff. Yeah, good evening, Stacey. One of these toys and the danger it presents is just plain creepy. Other toys on the list are dangerous, but you wouldn't know it at first glance. Little Kennedy is just six and a half months old. And like all babies, everything she picks up instantly goes into her mouth. So her mom has a full-time job keeping an eye out for toys that can harm her. Just trying to make sure that there's no pieces that could possibly break off, um, if it's even something that should be going in her mouth. This year, as they have for the last 32 years, the Florida Public Interest Research Group went shopping and compiled a list of the most dangerous toys. They found one popular toy with a big problem. This was the toy every child had to have. The toy has a hidden danger. This fidget spinner has extreme level of toxic chemicals. So if little Kennedy put it in her mouth, it could harm her. This doll may look cute, but it has another kind of hidden danger. It has a Bluetooth feature so your child can talk to it. But the toy can be easily hacked, and strangers can then talk to your child. The doll is now banned in Germany. Then there are toys on the list with small batteries that pose severe health risks. I saw a child in my uh, time as a physician where uh, she had swallowed a watch battery and it had uh, eroded her esophagus or the feeding tube and she ended up uh, spending months and months and months in the hospital not able to eat. Yeah, if your child does swallow a battery, and it can happen, you may not see it. But if your child starts throwing up or shows other signs of a stomach bug, then you have to take them to the doctor as quickly as possible and let the doctor find out what's going on. Stacy, You don't want to do that over the holidays. Right. Thank you, Jeff.